friends welcome to my channel today i'm going to show us how to properly install a food tray so for those of us who doesn't know a food tray is a wooden tray or a basket tray filled with lots of goodies just like the one you saw on the screen so there are no particular things to put just play around with some food items drinks and chocolates with fruits okay so first of all we're going to make the food for some reasons i was home alone that day and I couldn't capture the cooking process, but I was able to capture this smoky pattern jollof at the end. Just look at how good it's looking. So first off, you're going to clean your tray, just like the one on the screen. Then I put the fish off camera because it was very soft and I struggled with it a lot. Then I went in with this red wine. Then the rose wine. And this fruit juice oh i love this fruit juice a lot and i went in with pringles and this is my favorite flavor and i always use it then that smoky pattern the love you saw earlier yes it's thin. then our special coconut rice then i tried fixing this plate just for i think the proteins but i couldn't find the balance so I was just trying to find a way to put it but it wasn't working out so I took it out. By the way, there are no particular ways of setting a food tree. Just anything can work so long as it looks good. Then I went in with my plate of salad and I plated this off camera as well. So I'm just trying to place it and balance it well. Then I brought in that MC platter again. And I added all my proteins for this client he wanted a full barbecue fish some chicken laps and some hot fish which I did so in this place I'm going to be adding in the chick the pieces of chicken and the fish When I went in with this lettuce, I always do this a lot because it beautifies the rice the more. This is the very little part of the lettuce Then I went in with my peppered prawns. I, all, I usually put this on top of the rice, both the jollof rice and the coconut rice, but I don't put it on my fried rice, except when I'm making seafood fried rice. Then I went in with this chocolate with far my cookies. And this is one of the very difficult parts because you're going to struggle to fix everything and make sure everything is sitting well and stay properly. I added another chocolate. yeah whenever i'm making a food tray i love mixing colors of apple the green and the red they come in very handy whenever i'm doing a food tray then i added some grapes yes for some reasons i bought the very wrong grapes because they were not much as i like it so i tried to put it on one of the apples so it could be visible yeah then i added my bounty chocolate I took this up just to find a balance because I noticed I had more other chocolates to add. Yes, and then I added another wafers. Struggling to fix everything in to find the balance. Then I brought in my Rovo chocolates. Then another one. I think this one is the mass chocolate. Yes. Then twigs and lost chocolates. You guys, I love this particular chocolate a lot. Then another bounty. 
and these chocolates i got at the counter after paying then i'm just trying to find a way to fix this last robot chocolate and yes this is our food tray everything has completely entered so i'm just going to put these lettuce to find a balance because i wouldn't want to put anything raw on the tray so i just use it as a plate or a seat for my pepper for my pepper sauce for the proteins then i added my salad dressing the more of the grapes then i added my sliced green peppers i always do this because i figured out it adds more beauty to my tray so i just add it on the rice the proteins and just anywhere i can fix it in in the tray just to add more beauty and you guys it actually does add more beauty to food tray okay then for some reason i added extra fish and i'm trying to balance it you guys just take a look at the work of my hands this is what i did so if you find this helpful like share and don't forget to comment subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button so you're going to get notified whenever i post another video bye